This is intermediate. I'm a beginner. <laughs> Whether you're actually proficient or not in Excel, here's a function that every single user needs to know. The function's called XLOOKUP and here's how to use it. Let's say that you have a table with a list of employee names, IDs, departments, years of experience, and their salaries. And you're in charge of looking up the departments and years of experience of these given employee names. Well, instead of manually looking through your table, you can simply use XLOOKUP. Here's how. Click on your first cell, then type equals XLOOKUP, and then for your first argument, you're going to select your lookup value, which would be the first employee name that we're looking up. Then we'll type a comma, and then for the second argument, we're going to select our lookup array aka the column that contains our lookup value. Well, that would be the employee name column so I can hover above and then click the arrow like so. Then I'll type another comma and then for the third argument I'm going to select our return array. This would be the column or columns in which our desired outputs would be. So that would be the department and years of experience column. So I could go ahead and select both by clicking above and dragging like so and then type another comma and then for the next argument I could specify what I want to display in case the value is not found. If I want to skip this I can type another comma and and then for the match mode, the next argument, I'm going to go ahead and type a zero for an exact match. And once we type that, we'll go ahead and close it off and then press enter. And then I can go ahead and select my row, click and drag my fill handle, and that's it. That's how to use XLOOKUP to look up values in your tables quickly. And if you want to learn 26 Excel shortcuts that'll save you time and boost your productivity, you can go ahead and grab my cheat sheet by going to my profile.